Hey there, Cancer. Welcome. Okay, this is timeless reading. So whenever you have to come across, that's when you meant to see it. This is what is being said, revealed, and or hidden about you. It also could be about other people too. I'm trying to tap into your energy, but you might be finding out things about other people. So let's see what's being said. Letting go. Learn to let go. Someone might be thinking you should be letting go. Maybe you might be talking about that. Or maybe someone is talking about someone else letting go. Let's see. We have here justice. Okay. So let go. I almost feel like it's saying let go and let God. That justice will be served here. Feels like that type of energy. Okay. So Libra energy. Let's get more onto that. Someone might be talking about you getting your justice. That things are working out. Let's see. We have here North Node. Destiny. Fate, evolution, finding life path, karmic challenges, and rewards. So it feels like whatever this is, things are coming into play that are going to be just. And we have fulfillment, wish, wish fulfillment, nine of cups, success, achievements, happy outcome. So you might have been going through a lot, but now things are working in your favor and people are talking about it. past suffering, past affecting the present, its lack of betrayal victim let the past go that's what they're saying about letting go things are changing so that's what someone might be talking about they might be seeing that things are changing for you but you might be still um you know playing the victim don't do that because that's going to bring the victim energy that's the energy i'm feeling for someone that things are actually looking better looking good but the person likes the tension whoever the, this is not going to be for everyone this could be someone that is, is not you, that someone else is doing, that someone's talking about. But this is feels like someone has that, likes that attention they get when they, they say, oh, woe is me. But that's not good because it makes more bad things come. Let's see here. We have here the Page of Cups. So this is an offer coming in. Or um, it could be from a Scorpio Cancer Pisces. It could be also Apology. And we have a Two of a Swords. You're sort of not sure what to do here. You're indecisive about this offer and we have here but it's gonna bring you a lot of happiness oh so so ugh. um they're gonna tell me over and over again get out of the victim get out of the victim someone plays the victim all the time and it's like even when things go good yeah but this happened well no 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 um keep on talking about what's good so more good comes let's get this um we have here the glasses. Someone's seen something for what it is. Or somebody wear glasses. Maybe the person is coming towards you wears glasses. But it might be someone's seen something they didn't see before. Maybe someone's noticing you. They didn't notice you before. There's something coming out like that. Let's see. So we have family. Alone tower marry truth there might be something being revealed here we have the tower scorpio um aries energy about the family about maybe someone being alone because someone may be, maybe the family didn't want someone to get married there's a truth coming out about marriage about the family about being alone. I don't know how this pertains to you. It might be some of the words, might be all the words. It, you could rearrange that, but something's coming out about something about married and the truth. It has something to do with the family. Okay. So now, oh, someone might be talking about that. So let's see what's being revealed here. We have intuition. Trust your intuition. See, you already know some things. Trust them because this that's what this is saying. Something's being revealed. But you already know it. Your intuition knows it. We have here the sun. Look at this. Happiness. You got the sun here twice. Leo energy. But also happiness coming in. I don't want to take another one there. Okay. So there's definitely half, something being revealed. Something is also clear. This is clarity too with the sun. Some Shine the light on something. The sun. The clarity. Something being shown here. And we have here the Empress. Ooh. Okay, so Empress is Libra Taurus energy. But this is could be you're coming into a time of prosperity here. Working together with others. A partnership, maybe. And we have here the death card. 
there's an ending that is re being revealed here that's going to be a big change, a big transition, rebirthing something here. The Empress could be giving birth to something new here. Uh, and this could be rebirth, working together with others here. Empress is the most prosperous card in the deck. So prosperity could be coming your way. Someone's looking back over here as what's being said. The Empress is looking back at what's being said about them. Okay, let's see. We have here open, recept receptive, opening up, generosity, gifts, assistance, six of pentacles. Yeah, the, you are getting blessed now. Money's come in. This is going to be revealed, from maybe from what you've been through, but things are happening. Remember, light work, transcendence, getting past conflict, spiritual awakening, inner shifts. You are changing. You're shifting. And you might be finding better people to hang out with now. Let's see the death card. We have Venus, an offer. So romance, love, beauty, creative arts, wealth, harmony, attraction, and offer. So this would be like the Page of Cups. And that's what we have here. So someone might be revealing their feelings to you, how they feel about you, what they think about you. Let's see. We have a, oh yeah, they're coming with a, a bottle opener for wine. So they're, they might be coming here to celebrate. Okay, we'll start. Oh, I put these cards backwards, didn't I? Yeah, well, that's okay. I did them in the reverse, but that's okay. Let's see. Um... Yeah, I'm going to get the, this is the page of cups, so I'm going to get some words on it. Let's see what the offer here. We have here change, drama, lover. Okay, so there's going to be a change to all this drama. There's a lover coming in. Or this lover is coming in saying, no, we got to change what's going on. The drama here that's going on. Okay, so now let's see what could be hidden from you or about you. We have here dreams. Believe in your dreams. So you're getting information what's been hidden in your dreams. Your intuition is very strong. So you could be dreaming about things and that's telling you things. Here at the bottom of the deck we have go with the flow. Let things happen. Just go with the flow. Let's see. We have here the emperor. Ooh, we have the empress and the emperor. Okay, so there is a divine connection coming together here. This is also saying... This could be, you might be dreaming about your emperor. I think you're the empress. You might be dreaming about your emperor. Could be in reverse here. And they're probably dreaming about you. How nice. Aries for the emperor. Let's see what's going on. This also could be your time dreams about having more power, being in control. And we have here. We have um, fears, illusions, limitations, anxiety, comfort zone, overthinking, negative outlook. Yeah, see, this is all in your head. This would be... Um, this would be the Nine of Swords. Someone is stressing out over something and making things bigger than they are. And then we have here, reflecting, shadow work, soul searching, deep introspection, evaluation, hermit energy, void period. So going within, looking for answers here. And then we have nurture. Compassion, love, sincere feelings, wants to take care of you protective see you're fearing things this person is coming in you might be fearing that they might want to control you but no they want to take care of you they want to protect you they don't want to control you okay and then we have here autumn harvest timing card the past is over starting over so soul growth clearing new intentions okay so that's good there's new intentions. things are starting over Things are going to be working in your favor. Just trust it. Okay, this card can want to come out. We have the King of Swords. You speak your truth. Here, the King of Swords. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Energy. I think you just need to speak your truth and be in your truth. You might be demanding truth from someone, something that's hidden. This is very intricate love here. So there's something complicated about something here. When I see this heart, I feel like this is very, you know, intricate the way that heart is. So, it's something could be a little complicated. But you could be making it more complicated too because you have the Knight of Swords, a uh, Knight of Nine of Swords. So we have here, okay, look, someone's swallowing their sword. You might be swallowing your words or swallowing. There's, there's something that, I don't know, there's like so much good that could come, but someone's got the negative um, energy here.
almost feels like some or else you could be making someone eat their words. This because I think this is you, the King of Swords. So maybe it's more like you're making someone eat their words because they weren't telling the truth. We have here the High Priestess. Yes. So your intuition is very strong. This also could be like we're in hidden, but this is also secrets. So we have the devil energy here. There is maybe a, a fear with the devil. Capricorn you could be dealing with. It also could be someone having addictions. Hidden addictions maybe. Or something being revealed or something being talked about. Because we have all these different placements. But it also could be um, jealousy, obsessiveness, possessiveness. Yeah. So let me get the words on the King of Swords, right? That's the only one we have here? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, Emperor. Yeah, okay. I kind of don't want to miss any words here. Okay, let's see what's going on with this King of Swords. Expect. Talk. Options. Jealousy, you see? That's, I sort of felt that on this devil. Someone expects someone to talk to you about options and jealousy. So something hidden is coming out. It might be someone wants to tell you that they're they're very jealous that you have other options. And they might have been keeping that hidden. But now they need to talk about it because they don't want you to go on with someone else. So, But you might already know this being the high priestess. Secrets, something hidden. Intuition, yeah. I think you already, of course, you sort of surmise this person. Or even they, most times you could tell when someone's jealous, but maybe they're better at hiding it. I don't know. <laughs> Let's see what um, signs you could be dealing with. The placement your chart, placement other people's charts, past, present, and future. We have here Leo. Scorpio. Taurus, Scorpio again, Cancer, and we have Aquarius. Okay, so placement in your chart, placement other people's chart, past, present, and future. Leo, Scorpio, Taurus, Scorpio, Cancer, and Aquarius. Okay, so guys, if this does not resonate with you and you just checked out your sun sign, check out your moon, your rising, your Venus sign, something might resonate with you more. It might give you that missing piece, that missing link. The part of the puzzle makes everything click together. Thank you so much for all your love and support. I truly appreciate you guys. I love you so much. Thank you for your likes, your shares, subscribes, your comments, and I hope to see you all again real soon. Thank you.